Hello everyone, welcome to Infinity Physics. In this lecture, we will discuss a question related to electrostatic. The question given, a charge ball B is hanged from a silk thread S which makes an angle theta with a large charge conducting sheet S as shown in the figure. The surface charge density sigma of the sheet is proportional to that is we have to find that the sigma is proportional to which of this given quantity. So here we have a charge ball B and a charge plate or a charge sheet having charge density sigma and here the angle between the charge and the sheet is theta. So if we try to analyze this situation away from like you are uh, pulling a pendulum away from its center similarly the charge is getting pushed by the electrostatic force from this plate and the uh, gravitational force is try to uh, that is its weight is pulling its downward due to this there is a tension in the string now if we try to find the horizontal and vertical components of the tension we find that this component is t cos theta and this component is t sin theta now the charge is in equilibrium so the vertical component is equals to vertical component and horizontal component is equals to horizontal component so here we have q e and t sin theta both are equal and opposite so we can write t sin theta is equals to q e where q e is the electrostatic force and t sin theta is the sin component of the tension similarly m g and t cos theta balance each other so we can say t cos theta is equals to m g now if we take the ratio of t sin theta and t cos theta we get this kind of equation so here t sin theta by t cos theta is equals to q e by m g now t t cancel so we get sin theta by cos theta and sin theta by cos theta is equals to tan theta now from the Gauss law we can obtain E is equals to electric field is equals to sigma by epsilon naught right where sigma is the surface charge density so here we have Q in this equation so instead of Q we can put here Q by epsilon naught now here Q is constant epsilon naught is constant mass of the charge is constant and gravitational acceleration is also also constant also the surface charge density is constant but in the question it is asked that we have to find the relation between the theta and the uh, charge density sigma so here you can clearly observe that sigma charge density is proportional to tan theta right so if we see the question we get our answer that is the sigma the charge density of the sheet is proportional to tan theta hence the correct answer is d have a nice day